I made this list based on my personal opinion and I'll try to help you find the right one for your needs. To see the most up-to-date prices and find out more information about these monitors, you can check out the links in the description below. Before we start, I have a question for you guys. Which monitor are you using right now and would you recommend it? Let me know in the comments. Number 5. AOC CQ34G2 – Best Ultra Wide Monitor the AOC CQ34G2 is one of the most affordable 3440 by 1440 144 Hz ultra wide gaming monitors, yet it offers a versatile design, an immersive image quality, and numerous extra features. It's a 144 Hz monitor with native FreeSync variable refresh rate or VRR support, and it's G Sync compatible. The input lag is extremely low, but sadly, the response time is slow, resulting in motion blur. Luckily, it has a black frame insertion feature to help improve the appearance of motion. This monitor has a VA panel with a very good contrast ratio, and it has surprisingly fairly wide viewing angles. So it's still a good choice if you need to share your screen with a friend, but unfortunately, it has very limited ergonomics. This monitor doesn't support HDR, but on the upside, it has good overall picture quality with great out-of-the-box color accuracy, and it has great peak brightness. Connectivity options are abundant and include two HDMI 2.0 ports, two DisplayPort 1.4 inputs, a headphone jack and one upstream and four downstream USB 3.0 ports, one with quick charging. Standard solid and features a 5-inch height adjustment with 30-degree swivel to either side and 21.5-degree back tilt. Movements are firm and secure with no play. If you'd rather use an aftermarket mount solution, the stand unsnaps to reveal a 100mm Visa bolt pattern. It's one of the best ultra-wide and curved monitors at this price range. Number 4. BenQ EL2870U – Best 4K Monitor The BenQ EL2870U is ideally suited for movie watching and general computing tasks. It's not one of the best 4K gaming monitors, but performs well when gaming with FreeSync. However, hardcore players will want a faster monitor. Ultra HD is more than just 3840 by 2160 resolution. There are plenty of monitors that offer just that, but to correctly support the latest content, you'll need HDR and extended color support. The EL2870U supports the most common HDR standard, HDR10, which is also found on Ultra HD Blu-ray and in streamed content. The panel has a 10-bit native color depth, which checks another box. In fact, the only thing missing here is the DCI-P3 color gamut, which is wider than standard RGB or sRGB. The EL2870U's look is simple and understated with a matte black cabinet with half-inch bezels and a stand that can tilt but doesn't offer height, swivel or pivot adjustments. At the back are four Visa mount holes for use with an optional wall mounting kit. The EL2870U has a basic set of ports including two HDMI 2.0 inputs and one DisplayPort 1.4 input, all full-size plus an audio out jack. The ports face downward at the back of the monitor, a common if inconvenient configuration. It lacks USB ports, a pair of 2-watt speakers is built into the monitor. For those wanting 4K and HDR on a budget, the BenQ EL2870U would be a no-brainer. Number 3. Asus ProArt PA278QV – Best 1440p Monitor The Asus ProArt Display PA278QV is a very good budget-friendly monitor that's intended for creative professionals. Its superb ergonomics, high peak brightness and wide viewing angles making it a good fit for nearly any type of workspace. Specifically, the ProArt line has been designed for those who want high-end IVS displays for accurate color reproduction. The Asus ProArt PA278QV represents the lower end of the line. With its sub $300 price, this is one of the cheapest 27-inch IPS budget monitors on the market. For all-round use with a focus on productivity, the 2560x1440WQHD resolution can deliver a lot of benefit. The 27-inch screen size is particularly popular with this resolution in mind, with a range of panel types and refresh rates on offer. The Asus PA278QV offers an IPS-type panel with a slight bump in the refresh rate from the standard 60Hz to 75Hz. As a member of the ProArt series, its main focus is accurate color output. Even though the Asus PA278QV monitor is intended for professional use, it offers a good gaming experience too. Of course, at this price range, you could get a better, higher refresh rate gaming display, but it wouldn't have nearly as good color accuracy. Overall, the Asus ProArt PA278QV is an ideal budget monitor for video or photo editors who also like to do a bit of gaming on the side. You get accurate colors, smooth performance, excellent design, rich connectivity options, and plenty of additional features. 
Number 2. AOC 24G2 Best Gaming Monitor The AOC 24G2 is the latest iteration of the brand's 144Hz 1080p monitors that's always garnered acclaim with their reasonable prices and excellent performance. This model isn't as fast as TN variants when it comes to pixel response times, but its excellent color quality more than makes up for it. The IPS screen is vibrant, plus it won't need calibration unless you need absolute accuracy for editing on the side. But what makes the AOC 24G2 is its sub $200 pricing, which can't be beat if you're after a top brand with excellent out-of-the-box capabilities. The device also offers an improved overall aesthetic based on its predecessors, so the same reliability and simplicity can be seen with the 24G2U. This model isn't NVIDIA certified, but it's tested to work with FreeSync and G-Sync if you manually activate it. It looks sleek and modern, the monitor's height can be adjusted to provide you with the most comfortable gameplay. In addition to this, it protects your eyes from glare after long periods with the AOC Blue Mode. For that price, you won't find better. Its IPS panel offers color rendering well above the competition, and the responsiveness of the panel surpasses IPS monitors at this price. If you're looking for the ideal compromise in terms of color rendering, responsiveness, and of course the price, then there's no need to go further. Number 1. Dell U2518D – Best Overall The Dell UltraSharp U2518D is a QHD 25-inch IPS LCD monitor that's good for most usages. It has great ergonomics and a good picture quality, with great peak brightness and good reflection handling, making it a suitable choice for brighter rooms. The Dell UltraSharp U2518D stems from a series of UltraSharp monitors that put color accuracy into sharp focus. All their monitors have a wide color gamut, covering close to 98% of the sRGB color space to deliver deep color saturation. This is the kind of color support that makes it one of the best monitors for video editing. This specific Dell monitor has a peak brightness of 350 nits, which isn't too bad, and a contrast ratio of 1000 to 1 for a high contrast range of shades. The Dell U2518D comes with excellent factory calibration that deems it ready for use straight out of the box. Design-wise, this Dell monitor looks simple yet elegant, much better than the competition. It comes in matte black and gunmetal grey, and its thin infinity-edge bezels allow for a multi-display setup. The Dell U2518D offers great viewing angles at 160 degrees both horizontally and vertically. The display can also be tilted and swiveled at a considerably wide range and have its height adjusted to the user's comfort level. Its connectivity options are also diverse with one display port, one mini display port, one display port out, one HDMI port, one DVI DV port, five USB 3.0 ports, and one AC power connector for the power cable. Overall, it's an amazing all-rounder that can handle anything you throw at it. Buying Guide Different kinds of panels The key panel types used in desktop displays are Twisted Pneumatic or TN, In-Plane Switching or IPS, Vertical Alignment VA, Patterned Vertical Alignment or PVA, Super PVA or SPVA, and Multi-Domain Vertical Alignment or MVA. Refresh Rate Refresh Rates – Bigger is Better this tells you the number of times your monitor updates with new information per second, stated in Hertz or HZ, and therefore how many frames per second or FPS the monitor can display. Bigger numbers equal smoother images. Refresh rate is especially important for gamers, so you'll want to shoot for a monitor with at least 75 Hertz. Most gaming monitors offer at least 144 Hertz, combined with the lowest response time you can find. And panel size. Monitors come in a wide variety of sizes, they go from 19 up to 48 inches. Depending on what you want to do with your monitor, you need to make sure you pick the correct size. For gaming, I'd recommend a maximum 27-inch panel. On the other hand, if productivity is your main goal, then an ultra-wide 32-inch plus panel would be a great fit for you.